I think one of the big challenges of our of our current uh, day and age is that this global capitalism, what I was talking about earlier, is is having a really strong uh, influence on the way we uh, we are living in our cities. And I think it's very vital that as an, as an architect, you you always keep on thinking how to keep the city accessible for uh, for all budgets and for everyone with uh, basically from all different uh, social standings. So this I see as a very important uh, challenge. But of course, there's there's one really big challenge uh, behind all of that, which is of course the uh, the climate uh, climate adaptation that we need to think about, and of course the sustainability. Uh, and as architects, we we hold the key, but uh, we are always dependent on our clients, because if our clients are not uh, ambitious in terms of sustainability or in terms of uh, social in in inclusivity, it's it's very hard for us as architects to to uh, to still design it in that way. So um, I think as architects, we need to keep on focusing on, uh, on educating our clients to a certain extent, or at least uh, helping them to create a better world. I think that for people that are approaching architecture, I think the main um, the main um, uh, drive you should have is to be really curious about architecture and not try to believe too much of what your architecture uh, teachers tell you. Um, I think the problem of a lot of architecture schools is that they are way too uh, obsessed with architecture as only a kind of uh, design practice. But architecture is so much more. It's also about detailing, it's about technology. It's about uh, sociology. It's about uh, capitalism in this in this day and age. It's about financing. It's about uh, uh, creating atmosphere. It's about softness. You know, it's not only about. Uh, it's also very much about teamwork. It's, it's definitely not about the lone ego uh, himself being the genius master. I really believe that architecture is so much more a teamwork than uh, than you are normally taught in architecture school. So for young architects uh, students and people uh, aspiring to become an architect, I would say really open your mind, be curious, and try to learn as much as you can outside of architecture.